<coughs> so, we are, here we are again, and before I do anything else, hey, hold on. Yes, that's it. So play the song time backwards, and you slow down time, which you need to do, otherwise you only have 72 minutes to complete the temple. So we'll slow it. I think, it, I think it's twice as slow or three times, I don't know. So we're gonna head off to the next temple, but uh, first things first, if you hit, strike these owl statues with your sword, uh, they change into this, and you can save with them, although I'm not going to be doing that, because I can save states, and they also are useful in uh, uh, other ways, which will be we'll go into detail later. Um, I'm just going to go and get some rupees. It's a good place to get rupees here. And I don't know why my game's lagging like this. So I go if you venture into East Clock Town, and you, there's a big a treasure chest with a hundred rupees that you can get over here. And I think you're supposed to get the bunny hook to see this, but I found that if you make Link roll before he jumps, he jumps a little bit further. Like so. So, yeah, so you don't, make, you don't really need the bunny hook. Uh, I'm probably going to do all the, the temples first, followed by the side quests to get masks and so on. And, yeah, so I'm going to get all the masks so that I can... It makes the final boss a lot easier if you have all masks. Oh yes, and this fellow, you think, if he's on errand in the swamp, time to a sword. He got a sword. See, I could have stolen his sword, but he respects anyone that has a sword. So, yeah, um... Uh, uh, term in a field, even though I've technically already been in here, but... So, yeah, I want to get the uh, something called the Fierce Deity Mask, which you need all the other masks to get, and that makes the final boss... I don't think I've ever completed the final boss without it, because he's quite hard. And here's a... These, these, these are pretty much just walking power-ups. So I'll head in this direction, I guess this is to the south. And there's something on that tree there. In fact, I think I may be about to invoke a cutscene. Thankfully not a, not a uh, glitchy cutscene. So... Yeah, that's supposed to be the skull bit. What what friends does he have? He doesn't. He just lives on his own in the lost woods in the previous game. Does he really have friends? I don't know. Yeah, I think it's supposed to be the same skull I'm not sure. Yeah, so Can, can fairies actually get wet? I'm not sure. So apparently he feels the cold, even though he's made of wood. But we will not question it. It's a it's a fantasy game. Ah, so now for a bit of frolicking, and this is Saria's song from the Ocarina of Time, which unfortunately we do not learn how to play in this game, because it's one of my favourite songs, well, probably my favourite song. And he's pretending to draw it, even though because of the pr it's because of the early graphics, he was actually already drawn before he got there. So ah. 
because nobody wanted to play with him because he was a jerk. He always plays pranks. And I don't know how to interpret this. Is this mask? Is the mask salesman asleep here? Did the skull could knock him unconscious or something? I don't know. I don't know what's supposed to happen. Is it? I guess I don't know. It's a, it's a weird place to go. I, I, I guess the skull kid just knocked him out cold. Anyway, that wasn't. That doesn't really help us much, but it's a nice little bit of backstory there. So we're gonna head yon yonder. Oh, I, I'm gonna get. I think I'll get ting, tingles met. I I just like to get them. You don't. Well, you do need them, but I, I like, I just like to have a map. So, as soon as I haven't got the bow yet, I'm going to have to change into this fellow. And this is the first time, so I can't skip this cutscene. I think they stole this, stole this concept from the mask of Jim Carrey. Sort of similar thing. And there's a bat there, which is blocking my way to a heart piece. So I'm going to. Oh no, sorry, there are more bats. Can I climb up without them hitting me? No, 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 ah! Oh. Screw it, I'm gonna, it's just a hot piece. I'm, I'm never, I never get all the hot pieces. Nope, missed. Not very, hey! Not very accurate, this, this bubble shooter. Doesn't help that he's moving up and down. Okay, come on, hit bloody time. And he stays in mid-air and he falls down and that's both his kneecaps broken. He looks he looks a bit like a telly tubby. Oh god, I, he, he thinks he's the same as me, but I, I think Link would kill himself if he if he was like this guy. Oh it's, it's just the same old speech every time you you get a nap from him. So Woodfall, 20 rupees. We'll... Oh, I haven't really that much else to spend it on. Why the hell would I want to steal those words? Stupid man. Okay, so now we're into the southern swamp. And there's one of those Dekus again. Uh, if you want to get his... Uh, use this flower there, you have to get, I think, you have to get the one from Clock Town and then trade it with him. But it just gets you a heart piece. I think there's a heart piece on top of that hut. Right, so once again, I've got one of the owl statues, which. There we go. And. Oh, he's sometimes these Deku thingies. Don't. They do not um, rise all the way out of the ground. It's when it's when they rise completely that you cut their stem and get this other deco stick. But um, no, I don't need to go in there yet. Now Link cannot swim in this water because it is poisoned. In fact, I think just, um, completing the dungeon in this place will um, make it up, make it no longer poisoned. But we, if we head in that direction, we cannot get any further because there's an octopus. Uh, so we need to head here. Yeah, that's it. Hit him so he So it is, uh, yeah. Then you get a Deku stick, which are more useful than Deku nuts. Uh, you can quite easily complete all the games without getting yourself Deku nuts. Right. Why am I staying as this idiot? Okay. Anything in these pots? So yeah, in that that's a potion shop, but um, I don't. I'm not gonna buy a potion. I, well, we have to use that in a minute. Okay. So this is just basically the Lost Woods again from Ocarina of Time, except this time you have to follow this monkey who unfortunately travels a lot faster than Link. You have to follow him. Maybe I should have got Bunny Hood for this. 
Oh, good lord. He's, he, fuck, he fucks around with you by going to the wrong exit first, and I would not be able to keep up with him if he didn't do that, so that's... that's... Now he's again. Okay, yeah. Ow. Stupid things. Okay, I think, I think we're at the end here. Yes. And what have we found? We have found one of the witches who we killed in Ocarina of Time. Although, apparently, I think in this game, they are on our side. So, she's been mugged by the Skull, skull Kid. Ah, she can't move. Uh, I guess she is an old lady, but... Uh, yeah, I don't have the potion to give her, so... Obviously, I'm going to go back to the potion shop to acquire that. And here we will find the other witch. They're, they're twins. I think they even have the same names in this game. So, wake up. Ooh, good lord. That's a bit of an overreaction. That's ridiculous. Yes, so she gives me the potion for free, and I think I can keep the bottle as well. Yes, the bottle's pretty easy to find in this game. So that's one already. I think this, you, get, you can get six altogether. So, yeah, so now we have to do this once again. Follow that. Follow the monkey once again. And I think I'll skip this. I think I'll not record this. So here we are again, we found this witch, so we'll talk to her again. And now I think game almost crashed that, so now I have a potion I can give us it. Actually it looks quite delicious. Red potion. Look. Strawberry or cherry flavor. So that's completely healed her, and ah, so she's sort of swamp poor guy because what? Oh good lord! What else would a witch be able to do for living? Ah, oh, now I now I get assault, get hampered by these monkeys. I have to talk to them. You have strange powers, no. We've been watching you. Oh, yeah. This is apparently how monkeys would talk. Uh, yeah, we gotta rescue their brother from the Deku Palace. Me. No, forget these. I need, do not need more Deku nuts. Maybe I should go. Oh, no, let's get this. This will only take a second. Got to get back to that hut, and where she will be. It will give us a free ride on the boat, which we need to use to get past the octopus. Now. Does he, does he recognise you, even if I'm a Deku? Okay, do I have to talk to this fellow first? No, I don't. Yes, I do. Oh, humans only. Huh. <laughs> so she doesn't recognise you. Okay. Now that is kind of creepy, the way her face is just hidden in the dark there. And I've got the picture box, which is pretty much a camera. You can only have one... You can only have one photograph saved on it at a time, which is pretty crappy. It's probably the crappiest camera you could ever have. Who, who is saying all this? Is that the witch again? So, really, I, there's nothing really to do here other than just wait for the boat. 
wait for the boat to get to the destination. Or well, I could take pictures here, but I don't really know what good it would do. I don't pick up. What is there? I've never noticed that before. Oh, beehive. I can't shoot it because I'm in the boat. I don't have arrows yet. Yeah, so, oh, yep, here we come. The octopus. Well, that's got, that must have hurt, but I guess that's what he gets for being in the way. So here we are, the Deku Palace, and I'm going to disembark here. Any time now. Yes. Yes, I am disembarked. And in we go. This place is the best music in the whole game. Huh. I think I may have to stop soon, because I think I'm at 15 minutes. Hmm. Didn't get that much done this part, though, well. 